हेलो एवरीवन आई एम मेघा पचौरी अलोंग विद माय प्रोजेक्ट पार्टनर देवेंद्र सिंह राघव वी आर द स्टूडेंट ऑफ बीटेक फाइनल ईयर इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स इंजीनियरिंग इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिजाइन अ डी लैच यूजिंग ट्रांसमिशन गेट इन कैडेंस फॉर दिस वी ग्रेटफुली एक्नोलेज सपोर्ट फ्रॉम चिप टू स्टार्टअप प्रोग्राम funded by Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology Government of India provided to Aligarh Muslim University because of this support we got industry standard tool and its training this work is a part of our course project that is digital ic design so let's start with the d latch tr using transmission gate implementation so for that you have to open the terminal Type the following commands. Virtuoso. This is your log file window. So, in order to design any schematic, you have to first you have to go on File, click on New. library and you have to name your library for example tlatch click on attach to an existing technology library okay now it will ask which technology file you want to connect i am using gptk45 click on that okay next go again on new cell view name your cell we latch the kind of session this is your schematic window where you have to create your schematic in order to create any schematic you have to choose the component from create instance select your library and you can select any component like nmos i am selecting place it like this you can select any component and to connect your component you can select the wire option and in this way you can complete your schematic so for this video as i have already created my schematic so i'll open that close it go to on file option open so this is our schematic for a d latch in this we are using two transmission gate and two inverter for creating a loop and one another inverter for giving a clock and clock bar so uh, in d latch we will give the input on d terminal and whatever i input we give on d terminal it will appear on the q as it is on the positive edge of the clock in the negative edge of the clock it will store the previous state so this is our d latch and next step we have to create a symbol go to option create cell view from cell view create a symbol here you have to define your pins left pins are d and clock top pins are pvt shaft this is your symbol and next step you have to create another file of a to test this circuit so as i have already created that i'll open that go to option this is my test bench file okay so this is a symbol we have created and in this window you have to give the input to the clock and the d terminal create the power supply to the vdt and ground check now you have to we have to see the simulation result for that you will go at the option launch 
click on run. This is our simulation result. This is the output queue, clock and the input. On the positive terminal, positive edge of the clock, you will get the output same as the input and on the negative edge of the clock, whatever the previous value of the input, it will store the same. Cross it. Next, we have to create a layout of our schematic. Okay, now we have to create a layout for the schematic of DLATCH. So I have already created my layout. I'll just open that layout. Go to File. Click on Open. Select the library. Click on Layout. This is my layout. So if you want to create your layout from the schematic, you have to go on the option launch and layout exit. So as I've already created my layout, so this is my layout. In layout, we have to just connect the transistor using metal and polysilicon layer and vias if you want to create a metal to the polysilicon layer. So this is my layout. So I have to take the screenshot of this layout Yeah, so next we have to check whether our layout and schematic are matched or not. So for that, you have to run LPS. So go to option Asura and click on run LPS. Make sure you have attached your technology file here. I have used 45 nanometer. So yeah, click on OK. It's in progress. Yeah, so LVS check is successful. There is no violation. So I'll just take the screenshot of this. Okay, so now we have to extract the capacitance file. So for that, you have to go on Asura again and run Quantus. Okay. Yeah, here, here you have to select the rule set RCX typical view extracted and in the extraction option yeah just click on ok ok Qantas run is successfully completed close this so now you have to make a configuration file of your schematic. So close this. Go to on your log file. Uh, so I have already created my configuration file. So if you have not created your configuration file, you just have to follow the steps like go on new, 
library select the same library and create the same cell in cell view write the name and in the type option you just have to select that configuration op option then your configuration file will be ready so as i have already created it so i will open that yeah this is the configuration file okay session so you have to save this file and in the tree view you have to attach your av extracted file which you have created during quantus run so i'm just attached Bring it after that. Just close it. Yes. Now we have to see the post simulation result of the configuration file. So just open that configuration file. Same procedure. Go to launch. ADL Outputs to be plotted, select on design, input, D terminal, clock, and output. Let's click on run. This is your post layout simulation result and yeah these results are same as we have seen in the schematic simulation results this is our output queue this is our clock and it is our input at positive edge of the clock output is same as the input at negative edge of the clock it is holding its previous value that is zero here so yeah Cross it. Next, we have to create our GDS file. Now we have to make the GDS file for the D latch. So for that, you have to go on option file click on export stream select the stream file df I'll give the name of the GDS file that is dot GDS so select the library Click on the out. Okay. Use automatic layer mapping. Technology library as we are using GPDK 45. Click on that.
translate okay so stream out translation is complete with zero error and zero warning so on no so click on file import stream select the stream file that is dlat gds which we have created open it uh, select the li create a library gds lib 145 uh, give the name top cell d flip flop ground attach the technology library dear map click on translate okay so stream in translation is complete there is zero error so ignore the warnings yes so here the gds lib 45 is attached to the technology library we can view that also so click on file open here is library select on d flip flop crown okay this is the layout 